Hello and welcome to Lake to Lake, a show about our beautiful city of Bellevue. I'm your host, Robin Steele. Today we're here at the gorgeous Bellevue Downtown Park with a special State of the City episode. This year has seen many challenges and many triumphs, and through it all, it's been inspiring to see how Bellevue continues to work together and thrive together. We start with a look at some of the city's key focus areas and actions taken this past year to support our community. There is hope and you hear, you know, the optimism kind of growing. The payroll protection program was an absolute lifesaver. We wouldn't have a business with, without those loans. So we actually live in the neighborhood. We live in an apartment right across. And, you know, we like to stop by and check out the uh, food truck. You know, I think especially, you know, we're working from home. Uh, you can come downstairs, have a good walk, especially in a beautiful day like this. Support the local business as well. Um, and then have some good food. Neighborhoods are important to the city. They're willing to invest in them and that they're willing to listen to the people who live in the neighborhoods. And it's one of the many reasons why I'm very proud to call the city of Bellevue my home. We've taken the whole family out here. It's very peaceful. It's very pleasant, I guess, to be on because of the shade, and then it's like really soft sunlight, and then the areas where you can see all the way to the water is just really pretty. Going from sleeping in the park for three months and then being here in that parking lot is a, uh, is a major accomplishment. I feel truly, truly blessed and happy that the city of Bellevue got me from the park through all of the city workers of our four agencies. And now I'm sitting here talking to you All done. This is very exciting, and we're so grateful for the fire department to go around to these homes and, and deliver this, because otherwise we may sit in limbo for months without this. It's good to get back to get everybody back to normal, keep the elders safer, the community is safer for us, get the kids back in schools and etc. We're very lucky to be doing this work here in Bellevue. The spirit of the community is strong, 
It has taken partnerships, collaboration, leadership, and a lot of hard work to make Bellevue what it is today. But I'm even more optimistic about our future, and I can't wait to help build and grow the Bellevue of tomorrow. As you just saw, there's a lot happening and our city leaders and community partners have done some amazing work this year. Recently, Bellevue Downtown Association President Patrick Bannon hosted the annual State of the City event with Mayor Lynn Robinson and Deputy Mayor Jared Newenhouse, where our leaders shared thoughts on some of the city's most important milestones. Bellevue Television covered the event and next we share a few highlights with you. Here are some excerpts from the 2021 State of the City. We're proud to present the State of the City conversation with the Mayor and Deputy Mayor. What a year it's been. Um, a year of many challenges, a year of loss in some cases, of change and perseverance and hope of things to come. Today we get to talk about what's going on in the city um, as shared by two very special guests who know the subject very well. I think the biggest challenge is going to be working with the families and the businesses that were struggling before COVID. I mean, this has just exacerbated any challenges that people are having in advance of COVID. And it's going to be really, I mean, fortunately, we live in a city that has poured every extra penny it has into human services, into small business support, and our large employers have joined us in doing that. Deputy Mayor, how is the city supporting recovery and preparing for what is a lot of growth on our, on our horizon? Our new economic development plan, which we just updated recently this year, um, uh, the, the entire council updated that. And on that, going back to um, the focus areas, is really focused on tourism, the small businesses, the restaurants, the cafes, um, and the creative economy. Claire, for example, who's the owner of the Belden Cafe, um, she is someone uh, who has survived the, the pandemic uh, because of residents going there, supporting her during this very difficult time. And, and, uh, and she has said, there's no other city I would want to be in than, than Bellevue because of the way uh, that we, we've handled this pandemic, but also the way that we have supported uh, these small businesses and cafes and, 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 and restaurants. And we've got 9 million square feet of office space, and 90% of it is already pre-leased. So, you know, Bellevue is really poised to really take off um, almost a, a V-shaped re re recovery, at least that's what we're hoping for, and, and what a lot of the economic indicators are pointing towards as well. As we anticipate growth in jobs and there's increasing demand for um, quality of life here in Bellevue, the City Council has been stepping through a number of policy updates. I have to say, I am so proud of the council that we have, of the people, of the deputy mayor and the rest of the council members. We're all very different. We all have different passions and expertise, but we function well together. And I feel like we have been working so hard during this time and have made good decisions. Really impressed with our city manager and our staff. If any city can make it through this and come out on top, it will be Bellevue. If you'd like to see the entire State of the City event, you can see it on Channel 21 or anytime on our Bellevue Television YouTube channel. We're almost at the end of our show and we wanna leave you with some images of another exciting project underway, the soon to be completed new entrance here at the Northeast corner of Bellevue Downtown Park. But first, if you have any feedback or questions about the show, please email us anytime at btv at bellevuewa.gov. Also be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for our latest video news and information. We hope you enjoyed our show featuring some of the reasons why Bellevue is the city where you want to be. I'm Robin Steele from all of us at Bellevue Television and the city of Bellevue. Thank you for watching and enjoy this look at another exciting project underway in Bellevue the new Northeast Gateway for Bellevue Downtown Park.